Hello, hello, people. What is going on? It's Puck. And I am back with some fresh Battlefield 3 gameplay. Uh, this is on the map. What is this map? Golf Vermin? Yeah, some nice knifing going on. And then. Yeah. But this this um, whole video will be split to different kill streaks of different maps and different modes. Um, there's a specific reason behind that. Uh, generally, I was going to start doing that as um, my commentaries because obviously the battles and the matches are so long on Battlefield 3 that to make a whole um, video would be way too long and the commentator would be way too long as well. And plus it wouldn't be that interesting because of the amount of deaths that go on throughout. So there you have it. So this was initially my idea to split the uh, gameplays up into sections and um, see how it goes for there. But I've got some new plans because I realised the reason um, for me not you know, being too motivated to make any content for this channel is not because I don't want to but because you know, first of all, recording on the PC is so much of an issue. First, you've got Fraps, which is beautiful quality and uh, runs nice and smooth in terms of the frames per second. But fucking takes up, f what is it, 3 gigs a video per 2 minutes um, a piece. So, you know, eventually it just started tearing into my uh, hardware and that. So, I ended up going for um, Bandicam. And that itself took up quite a bit of frames per second when I'm playing, so I didn't want to do that either. And um, sorry if I sound a bit distant or dead, but I just come back from my nine hour shift and it's now 8 a.m. So yeah, I'm not going to really sleep tonight, I'm going to leave it so I can get my sleeping patterns back to the night again. But uh, that's unrelated anyway. So let me just give you some insight as to what I'm going to do and what I have done. I have ordered Modern Warfare 3 on the PC because I find the PC for me easier in terms of uh, first person shooters because of the mouse and the accessibility of the keyboard. And um, because obviously I've been getting used to it with Battlefield 3, I'm enjoying it a lot more than I did with the uh, console. Because console for me, uh, to be honest, takes a bit more effort to be bothered to do with all the hand-eye coordination and it's more relaxed on the PC and I think I would uh, uh, it would be a lot more fun on the PC for me when it comes to Modern Warfare 3 and it would be a nice break from the gravity and all the uh, realistic or realism and I don't know why that Claymore didn't blow me up I don't know maybe because I only had like 2% life so it let me off <laughs> but um yeah, this is Operation Firestorm in case you didn't know. So yeah, I'm going to be doing Modern Warfare 3 and that's going to be my general commentaries. And for Battlefield 3, I'm going to um, I'm going to do kill streaks. Like if you saw my Battlefield Bad Company 2 ones, if not you can go check them out. There were a little series I did, and my bullets ran out, that's why I didn't kill him. There was a little series I did where I just did a, I had a kill streak of around 8 guys per, per se and uh, added some music and editing to it to make it feel like a uh, what's the word? What's the word I'm looking for? Come on, Pat! Come on, Pat! Um, I'm just gonna put flavour in place of the word I was thinking of because it yeah, all mood. Let's say to give it a mood or emotion and as I said, flavour to the piece. So it was almost it almost became an artistic piece to the kill streaks. So I like doing those things with the gameplay. And that's what I'm going to do with Battlefield 3 because it has more fluidity to the movement and of course, what's this bug up knife? <laughs> and more fluidity to the movement and of course, um, the graphics are mind blowing. So yeah, that's the future for that, Modern Warfare 3 commentaries and uh, kill streaks. Oh, and don't forget montages, I'm definitely going to get the montages out for Battlefield 3. I've also got a Battlefield Bad Company 2 montage I'm waiting to release. So, um... I don't know, let me know if you really want to see that because uh, it's an infantry montage because I didn't really involve myself too much with the vehicles on the console because I found the uh, control pad a bit too slow to handle whereas on the PC on Battlefield 3 I'm enjoying the, the vehicles a lot more and I'm getting myself involved in the matches in terms of team play etc, a lot more of everything really so 
it's going to be more of an all-rounder montage whereas the Battle for Bad Company 2 one is uh, solidly based on infantry but um, so yeah that's pretty much the future of my channel for then but um, also I'm going to be going back to Skyrim because I really did enjoy that game and I, I think I burned myself out so I had to take a break from it and uh, thus stopped recording as well but um, obviously some people have been talking to me about it and it's been getting me back into it so I'm definitely going to start doing more regular uh, live comms of those and also with Modern Warfare 3 I'll be doing live comms of the uh, survival because it'll be much easier to uh, do with the headset with the PC there's too much fiddling about with the console um, so yeah I'll also just before this whole thing ends um, something that I don't that I want to sort of alert everyone to and I'm sure there's a quite a few people out there who do know about it but um, if you don't then the SOPA bill which is a bill that will take away our rights to well not so much rights but yeah in a sense it is our rights to copyrighted content so I wouldn't be able to use you know music anyone else has created as that will be infringing and the system at the moment is that if I upload a um, a music piece that was from said person then if said person had a problem they would go to YouTube and contact them to say that I am using one of their pieces and then therefore YouTube would contact me and what's this bullshit what the fuck is that but yeah then YouTube would contact me and then they would then tell me to take the video down etc that's how the system is now whereas in the future SOPA if it gets passed will have the right to um, well, sue us for whatever they want and to uh, shut us down or shut, it will probably shut down 80% of YouTube itself um, just for using the content or for the content even to be anywhere in the presence even a link will be a copyrighted issue but yeah check that out SOPA capital letters S-O-P-A I'm not sure what it stands for but go aware yourself about that I don't even know if that makes sense I'm, I'm kind of tired but <laughs> who cares this has been part of Hope Joyed. peace <laughs>